usually the one who sells on Mercari and I made my own account and this is my second sale. I just sold these um, to somebody. I wore these one time. Um, so I'm trying, my goal is to try to generate more income by selling things I don't use. So I already am a big thrifter. So now I'm just going to just sell pieces. Speaking about getting rid of things, I'm actually on my way to go drop this bike off to a friend of mine gavin's way too tall for this bike so i asked my friend if she one of her kids can use the bike and she said yeah most definitely uh so here i go to drop it off we're going grocery shopping on a saturday evening my husband said that the last time he came here for me it was a zoo Yo, this coffee, you can never find it. It's Cuban coffee. And it's so good. So good. He ain't lied. Line's crazy. <laughs> it's not as bad as last time, though. Yeah, we're doing self checkout, but. I think if you went on a regular line, you get it. Yeah. We only have a little bit of things, anyways. Alright, usually Nakao and I guess how much we spent on here. And. Let's see who, let's see who gets it right. I think like 200. It's gonna sound crazy, I know, but everything here is like bulkish, so it's like. I think it's gonna be like 185. This alone is like probably like 20 bucks. I'll give it 185. Yeah, we're about to find out. I say 200. Now I'm bugging, 185 is low. Oh, and then we also have this down there. We don't even really have anything, but I mean, we have good stuff for like. I'm still gonna stick with my 185, even though I feel like it's kind of low. I think 200. We'll see. Yo, we're close. Yeah. We lost. We lost. <laughs> Did you scan the items under your coupon? The day is New Year's Eve, and I just finished cleaning up our apartment. I am lighting up an incense. I'm about to have a seat and um, take it all in as I wait for my husband to get home from work, so that we can head out to dinner and then come back and just bring in the new year together. I don't think I've mentioned, but there is an L Train Vintage now on Broadway in bed -Stuy. I just dropped off my packages and decided to just stop in um, really quickly. Nothing. I'm not looking for anything particular, just taking a look around. I think you guys noticed by now that I wear both men and women pieces. Um, this jacket right here, I kind of really like. I love the leather collar. Um, but I'm not buying it. I did pick up this vintage shirt dress for myself. The material is perfect for winter and the colors are pretty good too. What happened? I'm going in here real quick. Nakel's been going here since he was like a kid. We don't just go in here all the time. We don't. We don't come here at all. Yeah, baby, but I didn't. We need kind swabs and what else? Oh no, they just have like champions yeah, and stuff. Yeah, they have like the plate ones. Mm -hmm. All right. 
Oh, we came here for a drink? What I'm buying in here? And gloves for my job. I don't know if anybody on here like cooks and bakes and stuff, um, but I cook a lot. I bake from time to time. Um, I know how to make some regular Dutch oven bread or, you know, like that crusty bread. I know how to make bagels, you know, stuff like that. Um, and my next thing to learn how to make was sourdough bread. I love sourdough bread. Um, so somebody on Instagram, another fellow mom, um, she was very kind enough to send me some of her sourdough starter. However, it's kind of like a reverse starter that she had. It's like some de dehydrated flour starter she had. So she was kind enough to send me some, and I'm so excited to get it going. Um, so yeah, hopefully I can uh, master sourdough baking as far as making pizza, making everything possible. I'm really excited. Look how thoughtful she was. She sent me the dehydrated starter, a recipe of sourdough bagels, a little packet about on how to rehydrate your starter, probably like the do's and don'ts and stuff. So cute. And this the what's included. She's so cute. You Cool thing about those shelves is that Neko and I are planning on building a hydroponics garden, and that is actually perfect um, for the hydroponics garden. So um, now it just gives us more incentive to actually just start it. Ooh. One of the things that I've always had a desire to do is have my own garden. Uh, living in New York City can be tricky because not all of us have some outdoor space. I live in an apartment in Brooklyn and we have no backyard, no fire escape, none of that. We barely even have light to keep our houseplants alive, to keep it real. We were first introduced to hydroponics some years ago um, because we were gifted a arrow garden, right? So we started looking into maybe buying a bigger one, but they were so expensive. We then started to research uh, DIY hydroponics in apartments until we found a video that was perfect. And if you're wondering, hydroponics is a type of soilless gardening that can be done indoors and outdoors as well. Coming here to buy some seeds. Since it's a soilless system, the plants depend on the water, the proper pH level of the water, the proper nutrients, and of course, the proper light amounts. Um, the easiest things to start with are lettuce, and I am doing some spinach to give it a try, and of course, some herbs, because that's also kind of easy too. Okay, well, this is <clears throat> week one down. Basil was out. These still haven't appeared. The first thing I also do with my coffee is go check out my garden, which as you can see, it is thriving. Um, I have some herbs that are finally growing out here. The one with the quarter is the cilantro, which um, they're, they're a little harder to grow. And in order for me to um, for me to germinate the seed, um, they suggested that we cover it with the quarter, I guess, to keep it nice and moist in there. 
And then here I have our basil. Um, I have some tomatoes growing here. I had to reset that one. Then I have, I forgot what I planted back. I have to Yo, lift this to, up today. We're gonna have to buy another um, Another stand. Everything's touching the light now. We're gonna have to buy more of these pieces. I wonder where we can buy these at. Like these pieces that screw on. Wow, Nike. Wow, honey. Congratulations. Good action. It took us a little while to finally do it, but we did it. Yeah, it took us a while to actually. At least we can say we know for sure hydroponics works. Yup. That's gonna be good for you. Thank you. 